our nursing apprenticeships uh, that we launched a couple of weeks ago. Um, our nursing associate apprentices um, who we've just had 18 um, start a couple of weeks ago. So a nursing associate um, is to bridge the gap between a healthcare assistant and a registered nurse and focus on the fundamental aspect of care uh, that's delivered in hospital. Um, the apprenticeship is a two-year apprenticeship um, which is on the job learning um, and some attendance at university. Um, so traditionally um, nurses who wanted to develop had to go um, to university so they would have had to leave a job and go to university to actually gain a qualification like this. The benefit for staff of doing it this way is that they get to work and earn at the same time so they still get a salary um, but they're also learning on the job. Um, and the benefits for us as an organisation is that people that already work for us so they know what the job involves, they're just building on their existing skill set. The first cohort have done really well. Um, they've all progressed into their second uh, year. They've all passed their exams and their assessments and they're all doing really well in practice. And the feedback from the areas that they've been in practice is all very positive. I guess there's a, a number of benefits of this approach. Uh, so it gives our existing staff um, a development pathway, it gives them a career pathway to follow. Um, so previously to this, if you came in as a healthcare assistant, there wasn't necessarily that many um, areas to progress into. This gives a really clear career pathway for our staff. It also recognises the skills that the staff already have. Um, and helps them uh, to see that we value their skill set and that we want to invest and develop them um, because they're important to the organisation. Uh, these staff that have been recruited into these roles um, are not planning to go out with of Cumbria, so it gives us a real benefit that we know that these staff will stay with us.